Hi, I'm Sylvia Miller, and uh, I'm very pleased to have my cards in the lovely My Muses card shop. Um, some of my cards um, show my collages on the front, and um, the way I make the collages is I, I feel as if I'm painting with paper. Um, I like vibrant colors and, and patterns to suggest a kind of abstract or magical version of the real world. Um, uh, and I also like to um, play with dimensions, so some things are flat and some things kind of pop out as three-dimensional. Um, in the case of this collage, I call it Hope Springs Eternal. Um, I made it during the pandemic when um, I felt disoriented by events and I was um, trying to feel hopeful while feeling sad and disoriented at the same time. So I mean hope springs eternal um, both earnestly and ironically at the same time. Another thing I did in this particular collage was I couldn't find any paper that was the right color um, for this vase here and so I made some and I do that sometimes I didn't make the paper but I made the color but through blending um, colored pencils and sometimes I do that with pencil or oil pastel when uh, my paper collection doesn't quite suit this card uh, shows one of my um, marbled paper designs and in this case um, I was trying to think of my tray of water um, where, where we make the marbled um, designs as a kind of canvas on which I was making an abstract composition. And in this case, I thought it came out looking um, very much like a tree or maybe we'd say the aura of a tree. So I call this piece Dryad. And I made a lot of collages in an eight and a half by 11 size during the pandemic because I was afraid to go to the store to have them scanned. And that was the size that I could scan at home. So um, I've been thinking a lot about what home means because I grew up uh, moving around a lot. And this particular piece is called Spring Wind and it evokes the feeling of a early day in spring when uh, there's a fresh wind and the sky feels very high. Um, and the house featured there is a house that I lived in in Dover, Massachusetts when I was eight and nine years old. And it was my mother's dream house and she was sad to leave it. This one, uh, I was doing a a technique of um, concentric circles of color, which is something we do with marbled paper, but I was moving my circles as I dropped them down and I created these um, strange shapes that look kind of like outer space and galaxies. So I call this one Morphosource. This one, I call topography because it really just looks kind of like looking at an aerial view of, of a landscape or maybe it looks like granite. And this one I called blossom. And here you can see a technique of moving the concentric circles of paint, um, pushing them a little bit with a skewer and as they started to flow, I combed them with a comb. And so I'm, I'm manipulating the forces of nature in, in a fascinating way. And I love how they all come out so different.